Hey there. Welcome to Sunday. Plain old Sunday. No international holidays. <laughs> and we're off. Go down Moses. Oh, helps play the right notes. before I started recording. Good mood, and that's why I'm laughing a lot. And I, I hope to stay that way throughout the entire hour of practice today. The transitions, the transitions are, what, are what's messing with me. Uh, that's just apparently going to be my weakness. messing with the pedal so it doesn't die um, and then the smoothness of the volume change I need to work on that so those are the those are the two things right now I'm going to focus on Play the correct notes. Uh -huh. Got 
to play the correct notes. What is going on? Sat there too long. Um, that's not right, is it? Is that a D? That's not a D. Is that an E? Must be an E. So again, I'm close. We're not, I don't think anyway, we're gonna go we're last a month on this song. So something, this, um, the thing that I still have issues with, and I pointed this out previously, and it, that, Part of why it's, it bothers me so is that I'm still struggling. So pressing the pedal down, um, so I need to get quicker with the pedal because I, when I hit, as soon as I hit this, the pedal needs to be moving before I have to lift to hit the second note there. The problem is. So not so bad on the first one because it's, there's no lift, but here. So this, this is uh, being damped, which is a damper pedal, before I hit, or before, or after I've released. So really, I, I, the struggle is, So it's already not ringing. You can't hear it anymore. That's what it should sound like still. Because I'm going to hit it twice. The problem is, my timing with the pedal is... So, chord and note, and then note by itself. Chord and note. And what I'm doing, and I don't know how to get quicker, is I'm lifting the note and the pedal at the same time, basically and then hitting, hitting the, the second note again. The problem is, while I'm doing that, this note that should be continuing to ring is not. The pro so I have, to, I have to get the pedal such that, so the whole thing is done before I release. Some reason I'm missing these the last the repeat of these this pair of notes. So introducing new errors as you know as per normal. I can do a review. It's just the page back. So as the hand goes down, the foot comes up, pedal again immediately. So I need to, as the hand goes down, the pedal goes up. Maybe a little more volume will make it a little more 
obvious that if I do it right. Maybe not speed, but so that's what it is. It's the hand goes down, foot comes up, simultaneous. So as the hand goes down, oops. trying to speed up the pedal or not necessarily speed up the pedal but move it forward um, just the teeny tiniest of bit because you know the way I'm doing it which is apparently not right pedal or play pedal play pedal play so it's chord then immediately lift and reset the pedal lift press chord lift press when it should be simultaneous chord and lift press without lifting the, the chord so like that imagine this is my foot on the pedal <laughs> so hand is going down foot is going up simultaneously and then the foot comes back down and it's gonna hold while I change to the next one So there will be the teeny tiniest bit of gap that's hopefully not really audible um, as the pedal or as the keys are coming down and the pedal is coming up. That little bit of overlap. Wow, how about that? I figured out why it's called that. Um, is not enough to be audible. So you play the chord. hard for me to sit here you know inside my body and really determine if I'm doing it right because I can't really tell if I'm hearing a gap or not because I know what my hand is doing time through and then we'll we'll move on for today this for a few days and then we'll start skipping it like we did previously um, with 
like triads and primary chords in A minor. Anyway, so here we are. Key of D minor, relative of F major. D minor is relative of F major. Hoorah. The reason I, I keep saying that twice is the title of the section is the key of D minor, relative of F major. And then the first sentence is, D minor is the relative of F major. <laughs> Both keys have the same key signature, one flat, which is B flat. Relative minor begins on the sixth tone of the major scale. The relative minor of F major is, therefore, D minor. So if we're looking at F, one <clears throat> with a B flat, one, two, three, four, one, two, three. No, we don't start over. One, two, three, four, five, six. There it is, which is D. Pretty cool how that works out. Um, and then from there, this this then becomes one. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, back to D. Uh, the minor scale shown above is the natural minor scale. Remember, the natural minor only uses notes that are found in the relative major scale. Hoorah. Moving on. The D harmonic minor scale. In the harmonic minor scale, the seventh tone is raised, ascending, and descending. The raised seventh in the key of D minor is C sharp. It is not included in the key signature, but is written as an accidental sharp each time it occurs. Accidental in quotes. Practice the D harmonic minor scale with hands separate. Begin slowly. So D, E, uh, F, G, A, B flat, C sharp, D. And then D, C sharp, B flat. skip the key after this and we skip the key before this. this song, Scarborough Fair, uh, moderately slow, 3-4 time, key of D minor, um, one flat, which is B flat. It does have a repeat, and I apologize, I, yeah, hoorah. I'll just apologize now for all the ons, and then I'll, I won't mention them again. <laughs> Um, so piano, mezzo piano, crescendo, diminuendo, mezzo forte, diminuendo, piano, diminuendo, piano, piano, pianissimo, pp, pianissimo, pianum, pianissimo, pianissimo. There's not another n in there. I keep wanting to say piano, pianissimo, <laughs> and it's not there. I never did look up how to say it. Anyway, so, all right, left hand begins with um, below middle C, so D, F, C 
sign in here and then back to D without the repeat. Just looking at the left hand for now.
Got to get the transitions is what is where I'm what I'm working on. And the pedal. Thanks for watching. I uh, hope you had a great day.